all right so for today's video we're gonna be talking about michael porter jr so as y'all can see by the title uh, I, know, I know the title says that michael porter jr will be the denver Nuggets' best player next season look i, I needed the title that, that that's not i don't think that's gonna happen 100 percent true but we're gonna be talking about michael porter jr the, that guy right there that you're seeing on the screen michael porter jr is gonna break out uh next season the the, the upcoming season uh, obviously the preseason started already this season michael I'm, I'm here to say it now if you're a nuggets fan you should be really excited because michael porter jr is going to turn into a superstar he's going to average 25 points per game jamal Mur why jamal murray is injured so he don't got to worry about jamal murray he just got paid like he literally got paid he got paid a lot of money so that's going to even motivate him even more this guy right here is going to average 25 points per game next season. I'm going to be the first one to say it. Come back to this video seven months from now during the middle of the NBA season, during All-Star break. Come back to this video and just comment down below that, that I've actually got it right. He's going to average 25 points per game, maybe even more than that. That guy right there, Michael Porter Jr., he's going to be an All-Star. He might even make the All-NBA. All that guy right there. And this is all assuming that he doesn't get injured. If he gets injured, okay, th this doesn't count. I'm just saying that if he can stay healthy, all that I said is going to happen. If he can stay healthy, he's going to be an all-star. He's going to be averaging 25 points per game. And he's going to potentially even make the All-NBA team as well. This is only if he can stay healthy. Because I know he had, the during the draft and stuff, I know he had... He has some injury issues, some injury concerns. But if he can stay healthy, I'm here to say it right now. He's going to break out. He's going to literally turn into a superstar. He's going to average 25 points per game. He might even make the All-NBA team. I'm going to be the first one to say it now, assuming that he doesn't get injured. I don't, I don't, honestly, I don't think he's going to be the Nuggets' best player. Like, Nikola Jokic, he just won. He won the MVP uh, uh, last season. So, that's not gonna happen Michael I know the title say something like that but we, we need a title for something but I don't I don't see that happening but now with Jamal Murray still being injured uh who knows when Jamal Murray is gonna come back to play Michael Porter Jr. has a lot more space now a lot more room now to to get the ball more and score more this guy is six foot ten six foot ten he can shoot over anybody he can shoot over anybody if it wasn't for his injury during the draft, this guy would be the number one pick in the 2018 NBA draft. He would be, yeah, he was after in 2018. He would be up there with Luka Doncic. If he never got injured during the draft, he would probably be on the same level as Luka Doncic right now. Call me crazy, but he'll be on the same level as Luka Doncic. Why? He'll be on a different team, most likely. He'll he, he probably be on the Phoenix Suns right now. The, the Suns had a number one pick in 2018. He'll be... Probably on the Phoenix Suns with Devin Booker right now, like balling out. So, and who knows? And who knows? Imagine a team with, with Michael Porter Jr. never got injured during the draft. Devin Booker and Chris Paul. You think that team would have won a championship last season? You think so? Who knows? But Michael Porter Jr. In my opinion, this guy right here is gonna break out next season. Not next season. This season, right? The the season that's gonna start. Technically, it's next season. It's gonna start, but. The season that's gonna start now, the 2021-22 season, this guy is gonna break out. I'm, I'm, I'm predicting that he's gonna average 25 points per game. He's gonna average a good amount of rebounds too. He, he just gonna be good. Trust me, he's gonna make the All Star. He might even make the All NBA team. And this is all. Of, if he gets injured, I don't want y'all coming back to this video and and like clowning me in the comment section. I'm just saying that if he can stay healthy, that's what's gonna happen to him. If he can stay healthy, y'all can come back to the video and say that I was damn right. That, that I was damn right on the uh, on the prediction. So, I know a lot of people have their own opinions on who's going to break out next season for the NBA. Which NBA young star, which NBA player is going to break out. I got this guy right here. Michael Porter Jr. 6'10". He can shoot over anybody. He's good at athleticism. One thing he needs to work more on is his defense. But, like, let's be... Let, 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 let's be honest, the NBA does not give a damn about defense. Let, let, let's be honest, NBA does not care about defense. Nikola Jokic 
it's not the it's not known for his defense. Damian Lillard is not Trey Young is not known for his defense. The NBA does not care about defense. Like so, other than that, Michael Porter Jr. He's gonna be good. I'm telling you right now, if you're a Nuggets fan, you should be really, really excited. You should be so excited for Michael Porter Jr. I know it sucks that Jamal Murray is injured. He got injured during. I honestly I forgot when Jamal Murray got injured, but yeah, that's all I gotta say. If you guys made it all the way to the end of the video, like this video if you agree with me. Like this video if you think that Michael Porter Jr. will break out next season. And also comment down below if you got anybody else that will break out that will definitely uh, get to the next level during this season. If you got anybody else, comment down below about this video. And if you're new, subscribe. You're on the road to 1,000 subs. And yeah, and I'm out.